3, 2, 1. Let's talk about numbers. How does 97 million sound? That's the number of deaths we could prevent if the global community makes the right investments in health and health systems over the next 15 years to achieve the health targets in the Sustainable Development Goals, the SDGs. That's 97 million people who would live full, active and productive lives because they don't die too young. So, what kind of investments do we need to make? Imagine if all countries could employ the health workers they need, build hospitals and clinics in the places they're needed, and provide vaccines and medicines to ensure everyone gets the health care they deserve. The World Health Organization's SDG Health Price Tag estimates the investments needed in 67 countries that make up 75% of the world's population. On top of what they already spend on health, these countries need additional investments of $3.9 trillion over 15 years. That's an extra $58 per person per year by 2030. We know what you're thinking. That's a lot of money. Can the world afford it? Well, yes and no. Most countries have the funds to make these investments if they choose to. But the world's poorest countries face a shortfall of up to $686 billion over 15 years. Those countries will continue to need assistance. Yes, the price of a healthy future might be high, but the cost of doing nothing is higher. Over 15 years, the right investments in health could add 535 million extra years of healthy living to the world's population. How do you put a price on that?